Hi everyone, my name is Dr. George Hanshaw. Please feel free to just call me George. And I am super excited to be here, but I'm even more excited that you're here because employee development is something that has been near and dear to my heart for my entire career. Because if we're not developing people, then we're moving backwards as an organization. And it's our, I actually think it's our uh, responsibility to always help people to grow and that's what makes our organization better so with all that being said we're going to have a fantastic time over these eight weeks i know we're not starting until uh march 4th i believe it is but it's first part of march when we start so i just wanted to kind of open up the classroom early and let you look around if you want so let's take a quick tour around the class first off this is our home page all of our announcements are going to be right here when you log in i tend to post multiple announcements throughout the week I always post a weekly overview of what uh, you have accomplished. And I also post a weekly preview of the, of the week coming up where I give, uh, where, where I give exact directions and answer some frequently asked questions about different assignments and things like that. So just a good overview of the week and what we want to do and some specifics, hopefully the directions and the examples are well, are, Good enough. So let's talk about how to navigate our class. A lot of times people used to go in through resources all the time. Check out weeks. Just click weeks. And then we go into whatever week we want. So we're going to be headed into week one. So we click week one and everything for week one is here. We have uh, an uh, overview for the week. So just kind of what we're going to be looking at. There's always a script if you prefer reading rather than watching it. So then there is, in our first week, is introductions. We're going to come back to this in a second. And we have faith integration. That's always going to be first every week from the following weeks. And then our learning activity, what we're going to do for the specific objectives for the week for whatever topic. In this case, it's going to be our employee development overview. It tells us what to read, watch, so it gives us a little bit of multimedia as well. And you can just follow this breadcrumb trail to navigate and our quiz right down there. And if you happen to forget anything, here's some friendly reminders right here. So with that being said, let's look at our first welcome discussion because it's kind of neat. You may have used these already. You may be comfortable with them. But I find these to be a fantastic way to communicate with each other and it's called a flip grid. So we're going to welcome each other right here. I put my video in real quick up top, just saying hello. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna click that button. Now my camera's being used for this. So when you click that button, it's gonna prompt you to do a few things such as uh, begin speaking and it's gonna automatically record what you do. So it's gonna be kind of a neat thing to do so we can get to know each other. Now that flip grid is also, oh, and I'm sorry, before we jump into that in our discussions, we don't have to go into the forums either and look for where the discussion is. We can click right there. That'll bring us directly to our first discussion. Click view full, and then it gives us our first discussion. We talk about the uh, Smart Goal Employee Development Worksheet. And to get back to where we are, we just simply press Return to Lessons. And any assignment that you have to do, you don't have to go into Assignments and look to see what assignment it is. Simply click the link, and that will bring you right to the assignment. Gives you all the directions that you need. So my hope is that this format gives you more time to learn, less time to figure out where things are. So. I just wanted to show and then return to lessons again and our grade book here. What I wanted to show you was, and let's see if I can pick out which week it was. Week two, we have a nice interactive video for the overview because that's always fun to have. We get to, yes, yeah, so we're going to choose a scenario. So in week two, it's going to be kind of neat. So we're going to choose a scenario. Well, I'll give you details on that later. The reason why I like it is because we're going to choose a scenario, and then we're actually going to give feedback where you're actually going to practice or role play right here in the flip grid. And so that gives us some practical experience as well. So that's going to be very fun. I hope you enjoy that as much as I always do. And let me go back there. And then what I do appreciate about this as well is once you 
put in your video, people can respond back to the video. So you're going to be getting responses to what you do from your peers. And I'm going to give you feedback of what you did right in here through a private link. So only you can see it and you'll get feedback from me in a not real time mode, but in video mode. So we can have a discussion back and forth if we need to about what we can do better, what went well, all that good stuff. So I'm just really excited to get started. That is an overview of our classroom. So once again, when you go to the home there, it's even going to give you directions, click weeks to begin. Always look for my announcements here because I'll put in videos, but use weeks. It makes things simpler than going through resources and trying to figure out where everything is. So it's all nice and ready and easy to go here. So everyone, I look forward to us getting started. Wanted to open this up early just so you had time to move around in it, see it if you choose to. If not, that's fine too, but I will see everyone in March. Have a fantastic term.